Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fireside Terra. Hope everybody's well. We're still doing the August bonus round. I have knocked out Taurus and Aries and um, kind of an uncomfortable bad news Betty situation with both of them. So let's try to get a more positive read out of somebody today. That would be awesome. I'm just shuffling. I said at the Taurus reading that I was going to shuffle them once and leave them, but I feel compelled to shuffle them every time. So we're just going to do that. Okay, one more, one more, two more, who's on top? Cancer, all right, lay that up there. What the hell am I doing? All right, Cancer, ooh, I get to use my new Gilded. Um, had to go to BAM the other day because my Gilded Tarot got wet. Somehow, I don't know if I like sat it in a puddle from a sweating cup. I don't know, but <sighs> had to replace it. Fell apart in my hand. I, I was super sad, but either way, I get to use a new deck. So cool beans. This reading will be for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to whatever you choose to do. The message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it's your journey, not mine. Cancer. I'm just throwing down cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay too. You can check your moon rising or Venus sign readings if you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid and all things can and maybe vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of the cross watcher and I appreciate all the cross watchings. Everybody who comes down to see me, everybody's welcome here. Thanks for coming and hanging out. If you feel so inclined, I'm barely awake. So if the throat chakra is not working, that's why. If you feel so inclined and you'd like to hit the, the subscribe button and the notification bell, that would be super awesome. Hit the like button. It all helps the channel and it is greatly appreciated. All right, before we do the invocation and get into your reading, there's two things we got to go over. One, never make a life-altering decision based on a tarot reading. It's just not a good idea. And by life-altering decision, I mean if it's going to destroy everything you've worked for, wreck your home, wreck your marriage, make you lose your job, everything you've ever worked for, I wouldn't listen to a deck of cards. And I mean anybody's, not just mine. So, that being said, go inside, sort it out for yourself. Two, if it's not your reading, not your story, not your message, leave the cards on the table and walk away because it's not for you. You can take what resonates. More than welcome to do that. Leave what does not. Don't don't force things to fit that don't fit because that just causes fights and drama and nobody needs that. So without further ado, Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, Archangels, I ask for any messages you have for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for the remainder of August, any extra messages that they need for August. Thanks for coming down and hanging out with me this morning. I appreciate you and I'm grateful and thankful for this gift that I've been given and I ask that you help me use clarity to accurately Bring cancer to their highest possible spiritual good and put them in their highest possible spiritual path. Cancer, what are you doing here? High Priestess, somebody's intuition is turned on. Could be dealing with a soulmate connection. It's a soulmate card. It's a major arcana. Represents Taurus. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Queen of Pentacles reversed for the past. Five of Pentacles reversed for the present. The Fool. For a future and possible outcome. Well, huh. Okay. Set that aside. Changing it up a little bit this round. Um, I put away the Universal Tarot. Because it's it was the first deck that I ever got. And I, I, I would die if anything horrible ever happened to it. And after the water incident with the gilded tarot. I'm like, you know what? This needs to be put away because that deck is special and it will forever hold a place in my heart. So it's put away. Okay. <laughs> so universe source spirit guides. Can I get the energy of the person that cancer is dealing with, please? 
energy, the person, the situation, the cancer is dealing with for the remainder of August. I'm feeling one more, one more, one more, one more, one more. Okay. Page of Pentacles reversed. Little incommunicado. All right. Queen of Pentacles upright, Three of Cups reversed, Strength, Well, Cancer. Now I'm intrigued. All right. Bought a new deck while I was at Books A Million the other day, picking up the Gilded. I'm in love with this deck. It is absolutely beautiful. I'm going to butcher somebody's name. Um, it's the Heaven and Earth Tarot by... Jack Saparoth and Jamie Elford. Holy crap. This is beautiful. It really is. I usually vibe with the decks that are, are colorful and vibrant. This is not so colorful. But it's the softness. The softness about it that I just absolutely love. It broke it justice. That's super weird. This might might involve a legal matter. <laughs> you know, just, just throwing that out there. Just weird where it broke. I really was just showing off the deck, but... It, the deck has a weird vibe to it, though. So, I don't know how often I'm going to use it after this set, but, you know, once I start a set, I try to do things the same way. I guess we'll figure that out, won't we? Okay. Universe spirit guides clarity for cancer and the person they're dealing with for the remainder of August, please. One more. Hi, Priestess, overall energy for Cancer. Can I get one, please? King of Swords. Possibly using your intuition. And it's telling you you need to make a head over heart decision in regards to a matter. Why would your intuition tell you to use your head? But, okay. You could be dealing with an air sign. You could have air in your chart. The moon reversed. Things are being illuminated. Things are starting to make sense. Things are coming to light. That's why. I love it when the tarot answers my questions. You're supposed to be logical about this. Because the universe is putting away the moon and bringing out the sun, possibly. Sometimes the tarot is about what you don't see. Okay. <coughs> Overall. 
for the person or situation Cancer is dealing with. Why is the Page of Pentacles reversed here? The Tower reversed. Trying to rebuild a tower somewhere might not necessarily be with you because the Page of Pentacles is reversed. They're not talking. There's no offers being given. One more. It winds up right. <laughs> They got a lot to say. I don't think they know how. They may not feel like they have the resources. It is just a page and the page is upside down. They want to rebuild the tower. They have a lot to say. Throw one more on it. reversed definitely got a burden they want to release definitely got some things to get off their chest it's a matter of how for them weird okay <sighs> do we want to fast forward first or do we want to continue in the here and now I think we're going to continue in the here and now before we look in the rear view mirror why is this five of pentacles reversed here for cancer for the here and the now Wanting to come out of the cold. Remember, all things can be vice versa. Roles can be reversed. Place yourself where you see fit. Why is the Five of Pentacles reversed here? like you would like to speak three of swords still heartbroken you're still heartbroken either you're still heartbroken and you know you broke their heart second three on the board I hate threes just throwing that out there really hate threes The three is a master number. Yeah, yeah. It's also a three. Mm. Upside down or right side up, it's a three. Mm. One more. Six of Cups. You miss the fuck out of this person. But there's heartbreak. The King of Swords very much guards his heart. Not a dude of emotion. He's emotional, but he doesn't show it. He really doesn't. There's feeling there. You miss them. Why is the Three of Cups reversed here? For the other side of this equation, for the other person in this equation, situation. Why is the Three of Cups reversed here for the present? It's not harmonious. It's not coming together. Magician reversed, it's not manifesting. They're burdened. They don't know how to say what needs to be said. They want to rebuild the tower. They just don't know how. It's not manifesting. It's not coming together. There's no communication. They don't know how to say what needs to be said. They don't know how to rebuild this. 
Now the Queen of Pentacles reversed. The, the three the Queen of Pentacles came out three times. It's only in the upright for their past energy. It's in the reverse on both sides in, in different placements. They don't feel like they're good enough. I don't feel like they're good enough. Wild. Wild. Oh my god. Okay. Rearview mirror. Queen of Pentacles reversed for Cancer. Why? Six of Swords reversed. Pentacles reversed. Wow. self-worth issues much? <clears throat> I'm feeling like you returned to this once and you got rejected. It affected your self-worth. Seven of Wands reverse defeat. Defeat. Succumbing to the inner demons. Succumbing to the inner demons. Defeat. Like the worst kind of do. Oh my god. Okay. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here in the upright for the past for their side? Empress. Lovers reversed. I have to get that. Hold on one second. Well, they hung up on me, so I guess it doesn't matter. Empress lovers reversed. This person might have been slightly uppity. They were looking for growth. They were looking for something that was going to grow. Lovers reversed by the lovers reversed. Princess of Cups reversed. There's no feeling there, there's no emotion. If there was, they didn't say it. They may have chose the wrong person. They may have. There was a choice here. I'm feeling like there was a choice and they chose the wrong cup. They regret it now. They certainly regret it now.
Interesting. Because now they want it to come back together. And it's not. Huh. Sudden realizations on both sides, I guess. Weird. Alright. Why is the fool here for cancer for the future? Why the fool? 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 Tell me about the fool. Ace of Pentacles reversed. New ventures, new paths. Leaving that house plan on the back porch because they broken hearted. And one more. I'll take two. The world and the two of swords. They're closing this cycle out and starting a new one. And it was not an easy decision to make. Why strength here for the person cancer is dealing with? Why strength? Why strength? Hi. Holding back, finding the strength to gain independence. They're just going to be good being single for a minute. I, I don't think they're going to get anything off their chest. I think they're going to continue to hold back. They understand the differences in this relationship. Full reversed, yeah. Probably not trusting their judgment. I'm going to take the one I saw and I'm going to put the rest back because a bunch of them jumped out at me. Eight of Pentacles reverse. Not going to put any energy into this. And they know what they did to you. I'm feeling a little bit of shame coming off of this. Cancer, I think they know what they did. I think they realize that they screwed up and they don't know how to fix it. I think they want to, but they don't know how. Oh my god, that's the Ten of Pentacles, not the Nine. I can't count because this is the Nine. Okay, well that being said, they're going to seek their Ten of Pentacles elsewhere and not put any energy into this because they understand the polarities in the relationship. Maybe they realize what they did. I don't trust their own judgment at this point. Maybe they're just going to work on their own pentacles. Nine of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Shadow side. The moon. The moon. Okay. Track and cancer track. And you need to, here's what you need to do, friends. Seek independence from this. Don't let this eat away at you. You get on your own and you know that you are. This was becoming a little bit toxic and obsessive. You need to avoid situations like that. You need to unbind yourself from this and rebuild yourself. Queen of Wands, because you know your worth. And you need to make sure other people know your worth. And you're very in tune with your intuition. And you need to use that intuition to guide you. Okay? 
and don't let it guide you down a smoky trail. You need to keep things illuminated. Seven of Pentacles reversed. It's all about a matter of divine timing. And it's not always your timetable. Unfortunately, it is not always your timetable. Whoa. Wasn't that the title of your last reading? I think it might have been. Was that you? I can't remember who it was. Somebody had a reading of... It's called Divine Timing for a reason. I guess I'll have to look that back up. But message applies to you as well. Try not to have salty feelings about this. And I'll say it again. Avoid emotional codependency. Avoid codependent issues in relationships. Seven of Swords reversed. You need to be honest with yourself. Three of Pentacles reversed about what's going to grow in your life and what's not. You need to end this cycle of unhappiness. Cut the things out of your life that no longer apply. Cut out what makes you unhappy. Queen of, Queen of Swords is generally a happy person. But she's all about self-honesty. So... You need to go inside and have that conversation with yourself and learn to be happy on your own. But only you can make that judgment call. Okay. Enough said. Cancer, I love you guys. Oh, shoot. Whoa. I almost forgot. This is the bonus round. You guys get crystal power cards. As if you didn't need an you know, like you need more inspiration, but I do this for people. Okay. What's the crystal power have to say? Whoa. Five of swords. I will heal myself. The five of swords. Yeah, it's the battle on the beach and in, in usual decks, but it's about healthy, healthy selfishness and doing what's best for you. And that's what you need to do right now. This ripped you to shreds. And if what's best for you is to close it out and cut it out of your life, that's what's best for you. It's going to help you heal. Do it. Allow that change to come. Fives are about change, and I just dropped a mess of cards. Okay, I'm going to take the one that flipped up. Page of Cups, I am as young as I choose to feel. Take the other one that flipped. Two of Swords. Whatever I decide, I will trust the outcome. Okay, I'm out of here. I love you. Know that you are loved and be blessed. And hopefully before the 31st of August, I'll catch you for your September read. But even if it's not before the 31st of August, know that there will be a next time. And I'll catch you next time.